So Debbie DA is looking a little bit better here now, so I definitely want to focus on this one here. Uh, target's 215 on this. Oh, we have a good gap here today. Uh, and the market's down. Well, flat in the Qs, down in the SPY. I mean, a mixed bag here overall, down in the diamonds. Uh, so a very, very sloppy, choppy market. I did a couple videos last night and I sent them. Again, as soon as we closed, we started selling off, uh, which is indicative of what, you know, really what I've been explaining. But we either go nowhere today or we sell off. Those are the two options. We're definitely not going to rally. Let's just focus on W day. That's a good gap. Any last minute questions? I'll look at the GSX. Oops. Um, this did break that area. So I can go back and look at this. But again, I think WDA is better. But this is this is good here. What was the other one? Low. This was the best option this week. I, I thought it could continue lower, but without the market, it didn't yesterday. I hope everyone got out of that. Let's look at what we're seeing here. Definitely a frustrating day yesterday because I was up in that spy and I didn't get out. And I, the only explanation I have for that is I just thought it was going to continue. Um, this is flat. Let's look at the banks. There is just definitely no momentum to the upside to carry us through, but we haven't had enough selling to drop. Still could happen today, but there's not much I can do about this right now. We can't trade this right now, but we're going to open lower. So, oh, look, this is this is going to be very spready, though. Even, even still, um, I don't think we're going to have a problem with a late open on this, though, but it's definitely, definitely... I don't think it's going to be this spready when it opens, but it's still going to be spready. I, I, I would figure in your mind a $3 stop maybe on this. Here, it's straightened up a little bit. Still kind of spreading. Let that settle down. GSX is pushing back. Market's lower. I don't know, maybe maybe it's gonna go today, people. I'm almost at the point where I'm just like, well, there's no point in watching it. It's either going to drop or it's not gonna drop, but it's definitely not gonna rally. Let's go back to this. That's still really spreading. Stop's gonna be 222.80. Let's do 99 by 80. 99 by 80, 218.99, just so you know. And do not jump the gun on this because if we get a better entry, then we do. There's not much you can do about it. 222.80. Yep. That was it. Here. WDA. Got to let it break. Here it goes. Here it goes. Beautiful entry. And it, this is here. 215. We're going to get it down to 215. This could even go to 212, 213, 212. Try to let this drop. I'm not going to miss my exit here today, though. I'll tell you that. I missed my exit in. Let's count all the things I missed my exit in this week. Spy yesterday. The whatchamacallit one the other day, Walmart. So there's the 215 number. But the way that this just pummeled itself down, I think this is going to continue. But you could have got out of that right at 215 if you hit it. If you hit it on time, you could have just taken it right out. I really think this, would be, based on the open, this is going to get crushed. But it's up to you.
Here we go. We're going to get it. This is a nice trade here. Here we go. Under 215, WDA. Here we go. Yeah, this could get to 210 even today. Now let me just go look around here. This market, I know it's going to fall. But if it happens Monday, it's going to happen without me. So plan of action for next week is Gerard is going to be doing the room. I'm going to go to PA. I need a break. So Gerard's going to be with you guys. Okay, I'm still in this. Perfect entry. Couldn't have gotten any better unless we did it at the high of the day, which we wouldn't have known what that was. Um, so we're trying to get this down. I knew it was going to be spready. It's an expensive stock. It does move very fast as well. So we kind of have to pay attention to this to make sure we don't miss it. I think we can get this down to 213, 212-ish. Let's see. I need to look up and see what um, what reports are out this morning. I forgot to do that. We have no. We have nothing else today. We have, we had nothing this morning and nothing. There wasn't anything this morning, and we have nothing out later. Pyro got out. He made $990 in 60 seconds. Great job, Pyro. Good job. Did anybody else get out right away? 215 was a target. I did tell you that this morning. It moves so quick, so fast. I think this has one more drop. And, and again, I, I'm not being a pig in this. I'm just reading this live as we're doing it. But I absolutely did miss my exit in the spy yesterday. It is easier to get out right away. And Pyro almost made 1000 bucks. But I think we're going to get this down again. Everybody else is still in it. If you did not do this, you know, you could you could do it. If you didn't get it, you had to really be paying attention and hit it immediately because it broke so fast. Let's double check our stop. Yeah, I mean, even though the spread is moving, I don't want to give it any room at all, to be quite honest with you. Check the market. Yeah, I mean, this just looks so good. But how many times can you do something until you say, well, whatever. I, I saw this sell off last night. We will discuss it. I mean, we could, we could get a hard sell off today. So it could happen into the close. Here we go, W day. This is a nice trade. Good close to the week. All in all, it, was, it still was a good week, but I think yesterday was unbelievably tricky. And some of the trades this week were so big, luckily, that I made out okay. But yesterday was just so strange. I said we were sidelined, and then we lifted. And I can't even tell you the reason that we lifted like we did, but it was almost the same thing that happened the previous day when we lifted right at that point, and then we had that hard sell-off into four. And then last night, we had a hard sell-off right at four. All indicative of the fact that we're lower. All you have to do is read the price action. It's so easy to see here that we're not getting bought. But, you know, the massive sell-off hasn't come in yet. Here we go, W day. Oh, we're going to get this under 215. Great. Time of the day is 9.37, beautiful call. Some of you got out, some of you are still in it. We don't want to miss our exit today. 2.10 is a dream target in this. I think we can get this down. 2.14, 2.13, we'll see. Like right now. Next five minutes or thereabouts. Two minutes, three minutes, four minutes.
know what the market's waiting for. <laughs> I do not know. Here we go, W day. Here we go. Under 215. Let it drop, drop, drop. And then this is our week. Let's see, let's see if this is gonna here here it goes here it goes let it drop don't you don't have to necessarily just quick it out of this right now give it a little bit of traction here if you just held through this come on come on come on come on come on here we go this is what we want to see here we go here we go here we go let's see if we can break 214 try to hang on if we're still in it come on here we go Did it break it? No, I don't think it did. No, it did not. Didn't break 214 yet. It's up to you. If you want to get out here, you can. I'm going to try to see if this can break. Come on, I know it's going to. Here we go. Oh, beautiful trade. You can get out here if you want, but I really think it's going to try to break 214. Here we go. Come on. Shit. I know this is going to break it. You could be out if you want. 214 on the nose. Two fourteen thirty nine. Two fourteen on the nose. Two fourteen. And this number is the 210. So, and we have such a good entry in this. Did anyone get out there? Is anyone still in it? No, I'm still in it and I, and I feel good about it. This is just a, we, we could not have had a better exit on this. This is not gonna back up. Jackie's out. Oh, Shower Singer's out, Devad's is out, Matthew's out, or Jackie's in it. Jackie's the only one left in it. I'm I'm gonna stay with this. And this isn't being a pig. We had such a good entry. Let me just look at one more thing. I mean, this went to many, many targets. Many, many targets. Foot Locker tanked. This was up this morning. I didn't like it as a long. We wouldn't have shorted this here. This did gap up. This is a mess. And quite frankly, the market is a mess until it wants to collapse, which who knows when that'll be. Amazon looks great too. Every single chart looks good, but to be honest with you, nothing's really moving. This week felt like a holiday week, despite the fact that it was not. I don't know why. Did people take off this week? I don't have the answers. There was very little traction in things this week. We're lucky we got the traction in the things that we did. Um, so me and Jackie are the only people left in this. Any questions that anyone wants to go over from anything from this, the market, or anything we did this week? So I'm off next week. Class this weekend, Gyro's doing the room. Any other questions? I'm waiting for this to drop down one more time. I'm pretty certain I'm gonna get it. Yeah, everybody, hope everybody has a good holiday. There's 
this goes. Hmm. What was the other one Jackie liked? GSX? This is starting to set up too. Kind of strange here again, with it being an ADS, but this is starting to set up. Here it goes, WDA, we're gonna get it. Jackie and me are the only one left in it. It's going. Yep. One more sell up in this and I'll be done. This was a nice trade. I mean, it, 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 we could have even added in it, but to be honest with you, it was moving so fast that God knows, you know, it was just like so quick. So it was just like, just play it on out. I think this is going to go to 210. Let's see how it acts. I'm not saying I'm holding it to there, but let's just see here. I can't remember the last time I traded this. It's been a long time. It's acting very well, though. I'll say that. Okay, low was 214. We got to get it back around through 215 and then through 214 and then wherever it goes. I don't even think 210 is a dream target. I think 205 is a dream target for this today. I think 210 is a normal target. That's my two cents. And who would buy this market here? I mean, honest to God. But it is trading in a very tight range. This is the week. Look at it. This is a Q's. Nowhere, 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 nowhere. Pretty crazy. Here it goes. It's going to go. Here it is. Is Jackie and me really the only pe two people left in it? It looks good. Let me just see if there's anything else. So Gyro is going to work with you guys next week. You should be fine. And I don't know if there is anything next week. So I would be careful, even though Gerard's going to be here. I would still be super duper careful. Dubad's got back in. Okay. So glad we were aggressive on this. It paid off. It's got break two fourteen now. We 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 don't have the market against us. I really feel like the market is either with us or not going to hurt us. So therefore, here it goes. It's gonna go. See, we can get at least one more dollar out of it, Jackie. At least. Let's see. Here it goes. It's going to go. Hand in the button here. Let's see how it breaks. Wow, what a nice trade. Totally deserve this. Market's going to fall too, but I don't know if it happens today. 
Here it goes. Come on. It's hesitating at that number 214. 214, 214, 214, 13, 214, 10, 214, 15. Every penny here. Penny by penny by penny. Here it goes. Come on. What is it waiting for? No one's buying this. Here it goes. Come on. Sometimes you just like, just short it more, but you can't push it down. It's either going to go or it's not. But it is going to go. Come on. Patience is a virtue. Oh, I will talk about one thing about the market. I just thought of whenever I get out of this, if we have time. Gosh, I could get a made a pot of coffee and come back till this is even still breaking. <laughs> I'm like, today would be nice. Or I'll just go make another pot of coffee. Today, 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 today. I didn't even have to play Snoopy Christmas music this morning to get this beautiful thing. Luck was on my side. I've been reading it right all week. Not everything has gone as big as I wanted it to, which is unfortunate. So we will go over one thing with the market, though. But trust me when I say we're lower. It's. I really don't want to do anything next week, though, when, I, when I'm not going to be here. I, I could, theoretically, but... I just don't think it's going to be worth it. And it, and if we if something happens next week, it'll be Monday morning. And then we'd have to get in the trades today. And I don't want to do that. Simon says, I, I've, I've never been here when Gyro says that. Because obviously he doesn't run the room when I'm here. So I don't really understand that. That's, that's between you guys and Gyro. Don't understand it. He's not here today, I just noticed. He's missing this. He's missing a good one. He's missing a great one. Nope, it's not ready. Anyways, in general, I'll just briefly discuss here what I was gonna say about the market. Um, one, oh, look at this. Is this going to go? <laughs> I'm gonna sit here all day. I'm gonna sit here all day and wait to see if I'm right, because I know I'm gonna be right. But I really want it to happen today. Um, anyways, and if the market does roll over today, this will go to 205, just FYI. Here it goes. WTA, just break it right now. Gosh darn it. I hope this breaks and drops. There, there it did. Beautiful. Yay, get it down, get it down, get it down. Here, try to hold it down through 1, 213. Oh, come on. This is very wiggly jiggly, isn't it? 213.44. Did you get out, Jackie? No. It broke and then went do. It's very wiggly jiggly. Um, anyways, I was saying about the market. One of the things that traders are notorious for doing, which is a death sentence here, WDA, come on. It was a death sentence is people have no conviction. They go from one thing to the other thing to the other thing to the other thing. They'll go, they'll short the market. It won't work. Then they'll kill it. They'll kill it with a loss. Then they'll go long. That won't work. They'll kill that with a loss. Then they'll short it. That won't work. They'll kill that with a loss. And I'm just saying the market, but people, people are doing that with the market right now, you know. But anyways, people change their bias all the time. Which way all the time? Here we go, WDA. And that is a disaster. Basically, chunking out losses little by little by little by little which total out to be a lot because people change their mind have no conviction don't know what to do i stick on what i believe in that's how we get it again even though it does it means that some trades do end up not working uh but the reality is when we get it we get it big and and when i'm right it, it really pays off oh come on i know this wants to break 213. 
is 43. I don't think this is really even going to bounce here. Let's just say. This was not the flush I was looking for. It did break the low. But do you know what I'm saying? So you have people doing both sides here of this market, uh, which is what people do and is a disaster for your account. Even though that at the time, maybe the loss is small, if you add up two, three, four, five, six, ten 10 losses, doing things in opposite directions, flip-flopping them, it comes, becomes a disaster. And then you have no conviction, anything, you don't know what you're doing. So we're sticking on what we're sticking on what I'm seeing in the chart. And again, it either works or it doesn't. So we'll see how today fares out. Well, this was this was a nice call. Here, this has got to break though. Come on, forty three was a low. Here it goes. Here it goes. Here it goes. Here it goes. Way yay! Oh, what a nice trade. Great end of the week. Let's see if it breaks two thirteen. Let's see if it does. I know it's going to. This is so hard, though. 213.10, 213.19. Do you get the point I'm trying to make about flip flopping, though? Yep, this is still going to go. Come on. Here it goes. Wow, this is a nice trade. Perfect, perfect gap and perfect entry. Here we go, and we're gonna have a perfect exit. Oh shoot, come on. Yep, it's gonna break. Here we go, here we go. Oh. There we go, we got it. Yay, here we go. Is anyone in this with you besides Jackie? Oh my gosh, this is fabulous, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Here we go. Ow, there. Oh, wow, that we absolutely deserved 150% and a great way to go into a holiday week. Wow, great trade. Whew, it's done. And here's the market. Well, I'm just gonna sit here all day and look at this chart and see if we fall off a planet. So let's look at it, let's talk about what I saw last night. Great job, Jackie, how much did you make? Dubai's got back in it, Dubai's got back in it. Anybody else? Whew. That like took all the energy in the world out of me. I was in bed in my pajamas at 6.30 last night. <laughs> I am not even kidding you. I seriously was. <laughs> I, I fell asleep and didn't even brush my teeth. That's how exhausted I was. And you can probably tell that in my videos I sent last night. <laughs> 